Would you eat this bowl of beef rice? South Korean researchers have succeeded in growing beef cells in rice grains, which they say could become a sustainable alternative source of protein that can replace farming cattle for meat. Professor Jin Ki Hong of Yonsei University in Seoul says the beef rice is the first of its kind, using grain particles as the base for cultivating animal muscle and fat cells. Here's how it works. Rice grains are first treated with enzymes to create an optimal environment for cell growth. Then they are infused with cultivated bovine cells. The result is a pinkish hybrid beef rice that contains approximately 8% more protein and 7% more fat than conventional rice. And the taste is also different. The Yonsei team is not the first to try and bring lab-grown meat products to the table. Companies around the world have launched cultivated meat. But Hong's team says rice represents a uniquely safe base to cultivate animal cells relative to soy or nuts because of a far lower incidence of allergy. Priced at roughly $2 per kilogram, and with a far smaller carbon footprint, Hong says cultured beef rice can potentially compete with traditional beef products. But he says challenges remain not only from a technical standpoint, but also in winning over customers with the right flavor and texture. Potential customers agree. Um, now it does not compare to beef yet, but as I see the research's early stages, so I, I would say um, it, it's a great way forward. Mm -hmm.